Panopto is one of the leading video management systems for higher education and large enterprises and is used by universities throughout the world to enable lecture capture and remote learning. So how can we make this easier to use from a single user interface that's controlling every other aspect of the room? We've recently introduced a new control module that allows the Panopto solution to seamlessly integrate into the AMX environment. Here's an example of a typical touch panel using the module. As part of this user interface design, we have all the control functions you'd expect to see, but alongside these, the user has access to the main functions of the Panopto system. In this example, there's a calendar function where the user can see a list of scheduled sessions or search for a specific session. They then select the one they want and start the recording. If there's no scheduled recording, you can just press the record button and this will create an ad hoc recording in the schedule. You can decide how long this recording is by using a fixed duration or by giving the user different options. When the recording's in progress, the indicated bar at the top of the panel turns from green to red. This helps to ensure that the person operating the system is clear that the session is now being recorded. This particular panel design even has a preview button which allows the user to view snapshots of the recording that's currently in progress. The recording can be paused at any time, if there needs to be a break for example, or if there's a confidential discussion that you don't want recorded. The Panopto system runs according to a schedule, which means that if the session overruns or is running late, you may need to extend the recording time. We've made this really simple by adding an extend button. In this example, we've set it to five minutes. So if you're running five minutes late, press the button once. If you're running 10 minutes late, press the button twice. The top bar in this panel design shows the remaining time for the recording, so it's easy to keep track of this. If you try to extend the recording and there's a clash with another session, you'll see a warning message to let you know that this can't be extended. When the session's over, just press the stop button. 